Howdy, it's Uncle Paul. Can you guess where I've been? Cousin Ethan is here. Yes. Ethan Who says he it? didn't trust these wimpy looking chairs. <laughs> I trust him. I've lost 100 pounds, so I trust him. Wow. I've already had three comments on my Starbucks <laughs> snap store. Two of them said white girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we did it. Oh, okay. <laughs> that van is whistling at me. Says, I may be able to catch that fat guy. <laughs> okay, so my nephew Ethan and I, we went to REI in Round Rock, Texas. Now that's the first time either one of us have been in an REI. And it was a really nice store and the people there were real nice. And when we left, uh, Ethan said, boy, they sure are enthusiastic. And uh, so, anyway, uh, I had a list of things and got several items that were on the list. First, uh, I got some new trekking poles, some Lecky trekking poles with the clamps. And uh, so I had to tighten those so they wouldn't collapse on me. And I've already used them uh, on a hike. And they worked well, so got those. By the way, everything that I bought there was on sale that day. So, okay. Next is this cat hole trowel. Um, it seems a little heavy, this handy. This handle is kind of heavy, but uh, you know, I don't want my shovel to break on me. So, but, uh, so that's what I have for now. Uh, next, the uh, Pinnacle Soloist from GSI, as far as my cook set. Uh, that up. I'm not sure, well I'm not going to keep probably everything uh, that has come with this. This bag right here is supposed to hold water so you're supposed to be, it's supposed to be a wash basin to be able to wash uh, your utensils, your pot and everything. So it, it's not that heavy but I know I could go lighter. I probably won't use that or take that. Uh, I like the handle. I like the size of the pot. I like the lid. It has a strainer on it. And it. this is supposed to be a holder for whatever little stove you use. I'm sure I won't use that. Uh, it also comes with a spoon. Uh, it's one of these that, that will slide and then clicks into place. Uh, I probably won't take this. I'm just afraid it won't hold up, you know, for you know nearly 2,200 miles. Uh, so I probably won't take it. I'll probably get something else. Uh, this cup comes with it. It's pretty lightweight. It's got uh, this uh, around it to to keep you from burning yourself. You can uh, hold it. Uh, I might not take this either. So, but. Uh, <laughs> 
I'll, I'll have some kind of cup, I'll have some kind of spoon. What I might do is get a bag that will hold uh, all these things plus a, um, plus a fuel canister uh, all together uh, since it wouldn't fit in this bag anyway, a fuel canister. So, okay, well that's my cook set. The next thing I got was the stove. And I went ahead and sprung for the pocket rocket. It was on sale too. And, you know, those work very well, uh, as, as most of you know. Uh, I probably uh, won't, I'm sure I won't take this little case with it. I'll probably just carry it in the pot with, you know, even with if I take the cup, put a spoon in there. Uh, and that's probably uh, how I'll use that. So uh, then I got the black, a black diamond headlamp, uh, 100, excuse me, uh, 100 lumens, black diamond uh, headlamp. And then finally on this trip, I got a, a footprint for the, the Copper Spur UL2 tent, uh, a big Agnes. Now. Uh, that was the tin I had decided on, but when I got to the store, they didn't have any in stock. They had some coming on a truck soon. I went ahead and while I was there, got the footprint for that tin. So that is what I purchased so far from REI. Well, I'm about to hike over to my brother's house. It's 1.7 miles from my house to his house. And so the plan is, is to hike over there and back. So there's some hills. So it's a nice, cool morning. So hopefully it should all go well. Okay, I am nearly to my brother's house and I'm going to take a break and then hike back home. Okay, I am back home after the walk to my brother's house and back. I stayed there too long. I was there for like an hour visiting, had some coffee, but uh, I neglected, it's, it's 1.7 miles from my house to his house. I neglected to time myself uh, on the way there. But on the way back, uh, I kind of went a slower pace. I was stiff already from sitting so long. But uh, I did time myself and I, uh, that 1.7 I did in uh, 50 minutes. So, you know, for me, and it's got some hills and everything, not too bad. But for me, that's not bad. So. Uh, so 3.4 miles uh, all together, and, uh, but it, it's, it's nice to be home and it's lunchtime. Well, just getting back from my doctor's appointment, and about to take my walk. Uh, well, he gave me some good news. I do not have to take my medication for diabetes any longer. Even 
my blood sugar so well even if I splurge it is uh, the situation that it's not uh, my blood sugar is not so sensitive that it can't handle you know a big meal every now and then or whatever so anyway so that's good news and also uh, he knows of my plans to through hike the Appalachian Trail and uh, come to find out he's hiked a section of it just recently back in October uh, in the Smokies so uh, so we talked about that and some other things but anyway just thought I would share with that good news with you making progress and now I've got to get off the blood pressure medication that's my next goal that's my final uh, pill that I'm taking and I am making progress on that uh, probably he said another 30 40 pounds uh, and I probably won't have to take that medication anymore so all right here we go Now, if you recall, last week I made my 30-day I made my 30-day weight loss challenge for the month of December. I want to have lost 130 pounds by January 1st. Now, uh, I am eating this week less than a thousand calories a day, more like between 500 and 700. Hurley, no. No, go away, go away, I'm talking, go away. Don't stare at me like that. No, 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 I know, you want some, no, you want some coffee? So, uh, but that's just this week. I do not plan to weigh until January 1st. One reason for that is because I uh, have a tendency when I weigh, I shoot for that goal and for that Sunday morning when I usually weigh and then once I weigh that morning, I use the day, or at least one meal of that day, sometimes all day, to splurge. So it's just, it's just not a good deal. So I am not planning on weighing until January 1st. And maybe that will help with this idea of splurging. So, and uh, welcome to my new subscribers. Thank you very much for, for joining us. And, uh, you know, we've got a hike coming up real soon at Guadalupe National Park. Looking real forward to that. I appreciate you watching. Please share my videos. Please subscribe. See you next week.